Chris from Brigandi Coins and Collectibles here in New York City. Happy holidays. We realize most of you won't be visiting New York this year, so we wanted to bring New York to you. Uh, we have some great new inventory. We haven't even posted it on our website yet, so I'm going to show it off to you. If you see anything you like, just give me a shout. Um, okay, so let's start right up here. We have a beautiful uh, John D. Rockefeller autograph, uh, mint condition, and it's huge. It's definitely the nicest and best Rockefeller I've ever seen. Uh, we have a Kennedy, John F. Kennedy autograph behind it. What I like about those, the early ones, that's a 1955 uh, Senate letterhead, is that you can actually read his autograph. Um, by the time he was president, his autograph had become so quick. You, it's Unless you know who it is, it's virtually uh, illegible. Um, so there's George Harrison. Here we have a Samuel Clemens, of course, Mark Twain. Um, going down here, we got a ton of stuff here. Um, we have Cobb, Koufax, Campanella, uh, even George Washington. Uh, let's see some more Cobb up top. Uh, DiMaggio, uh, 1927 Yankees, Tony Lazeri. A uh, ton of autographs. So here we have a Lou Gehrig on a 1930s scorecard. Uh, moving right along, let's go to the other side here. Some great autographs. Um, that's one of my favorite new pieces. It's a Thomas Edison signed uh, photo postcard uh, right around 1900. And the autograph is just absolutely uh, gorgeous. Um, that's as good as it gets. Uh, just a really phenomenal piece. Uh, st sticking with historical, we have a nice John Hancock autograph uh, right there. Uh, of course, Babe Ruth, uh, one of our best sellers. And here's another fantastic item we have, uh, Mark Twain, another signed photo postcard. Um, really don't see Mark Twain autographs on photos, especially when they're not personalized like that. Um, a ton of stuff. This, this stuff down here makes great gifts. Uh, just your, you know, more common autographs, but great names nonetheless. Um, let's see here, we got Sam, Sammy Davis Jr., David Wells, Pete Rose, Nolan Ryan, Johnny Unitas, Ford, Barra. Um, the names can go on and on. Here we have a great mantle jersey with an inscription, uh, 1951, pretty, uh, very desirable. And then I just posted this last night. This is our newest uh, acquisition. It's another J.P. Morgan uh, signed document from uh, 1886. Um, so a ton of new stuff, guys. Uh, we got a ton of framed items. These make great gifts as well. Uh, music, presidential, uh, historical, um, we do it all here. So if you have, if you see anything you like, let us know. Um, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.